don't forget that Oklahoma and Houston have never played one another, nor are they scheduled to down the road. So this is a recruiting war right here at the Sun Bowl. It's going to be really a good football game. For maybe a yard or so, number 80 is Bryant. Got a good, fast Astro turf here in the Sun Bowl. Third down and short. The flags are down. Boy, Lionel Wilson barely even got that hand off. Alan Polk was the carrier. 90 seconds. It was a race. Albert Watts, a very dangerous punt returner, is waiting back. He's got the fair catch signal call. Now lets it bounce, which is still legal. Hits the turf and bounces almost into the Houston bench. Concerned about not getting in a third and long situation. They want to be third and three. They've averaged five passes a game. They completed 41 for the entire year. They completed more passes in a pregame warm-up today than they have all season. <laughs> <laughs> the offensive line, by the way, averages 265 pounds from tackle to tackle. It is gigantic. That's the reason they can run. Here's the wishbone. Good handoff. Looks like Stanley Wilson coming off the right side. And Kelly McDonald, Callaway, the young man that played so well this year. McGallion at the nose. Terry Monroe. And, of course, on the outside. Weedy Harris and Grady Turner, two linebackers. And a secondary that has 25 interceptions. LaCroix, Vonner, Love, and Easton. Here's the first pass. Overthrown. Trying for number 82. <laughs> Here it is on third down. And call it eight yards. Ooh, option. Good defensive play. Both the punting and the kicking, the field goal kicking. Oh, over the end over in kick taken at the 15 yard line by Daryl Jackson. Not too much on the run back. And there's Old Glory. A little breeze. He's right away from toss. Back to Alan Polk. And Polk has some yardage. Picks up about seven yards. Still playing extremely well. That time he picked up eight yards. To the right side now. Wilson keeps the ball. Makes the first down and gets almost to the 40 yard line. Might be one of the best athletes to play quarterback uh, that we've ever seen if he works on his passing. The inside counter, handoff to number 43. That's Dwayne Love, I believe, that's in there. Now, I think that girl. Incredible percentage, 866 on the win column. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Down call. Straight dive and the toss passes. Juggling and then caught. A nice looking play. Lionel Wilson had nine touchdown passes. Here's the reverse handoff inside to Durham again, number 43. Not much that time. Those big strong linemen up front do a good job of making something happen. Second down 10, the first good drive by either team. Here's the reverse handoff. Now the pass by Wilson again. It's caught. That's Mark Ford. 10.45 left in the first quarter, and the Cougars are driving. Back inside, not a lot. A good-looking young team. That's Lionel Wilson. Here's the inside handoff. He's trying to throw it. He's being blitzed and dropped. Number 25 came up very quickly. Okay, a third down, and call it seven yards to go. 17 yards to go. Pardon me, following the set. Good handoff. Dumped out in the flat. A good run by Alan Polk, who is a real good pass receiver. Mike Clendenin. He won three games kicking field goals. He only tried two in his whole high school career. Must be learning. This is up. It's long enough. Is it inside? It looks awfully good. It's no good. It's just off to the left. Just off to the left. And out to the 20 yard line. The ball will come. And Wilson picked up seven. Here's the inside fake and give to Wilson. And that's the key. That's the key to that wishbone is does he give it to that fullback? And the suitors get it rolling with the bone, as they call it. Here's the counter move, and the option play a fumble, and that's been the Oklahoma problem, but maybe it was re-recovered by Oklahoma. Let's see. They fumbled far from out of the state. They're going to get the best one. Here's Shepard. He doesn't throw a lot, but he does this time. Overthrow, spike, and almost intercepted. There's a flag on the play. In 11 games, they've only completed 41 passes. First down. Inside play. Number 32, you're used to him by now, Stanley Wilson. Making him force him to try to throw the ball rather than just run it because that's what they do best. Here's Wilson again. He's got the first down before he's knocked back. The eight-man front and with all the stunts that are going on. Very intelligent approach. It's incident. Wishbone call on the first down. A fumble. Looks like that Oklahoma recovered it again. Second down and 10, and the young man may be forced to throw again. That's Shepard, the quarterback. Hand off to Wilson inside. Gets inside the 35-yard line and ends up on the 42. All right, third down and five. Will Shepard throw it? He's going to option to the weak side of the formation. A good-looking runner. Oh, he's down to the... He's going to score a touchdown. Shepard scores again. His 14th touchdown of the season. 
He is slippery. He's not big at about 185 pounds. The University of Houston, the third transfer. He was supposed to be a Mark Mandan. It's good. Oklahoma on top, running the football, fumbling a little bit, but keeping it going and using their great little quarterback to score. It's 7-0. Seldom used. He's a, he didn't punt much this year because they kept running the football down people's throats. Here's the key. That's Jordan back to take it. It's out of the end zone and almost in Mexico, depending if the wind conditions were proper. Here's the reverse roll by Lyle. He wants to throw it. Now he doesn't miss. He keeps it. Gets to the 26-yard line. A pickup of six yards by Wilson. He's going to keep it this time in options at the outside. That's Barrett. Or Alan Polk, pardon me. Alan Polk takes it. Third down and one. Short yardage. Let's see what Oklahoma does. Make a good play. Get penetration. A bad toss outside. That is a lateral. It's taken. He's going to be close to it. Alan Polk took it on the double bounce. Lionel looking around now. He won't do much play changing, but he's going to throw this time back to the left side. Intended for, for Fee. Both teams would rather win their conferences, of course, and decide to play it all out today anyway. Long call by Wilson. Reverse now. Spinning out the throw. It's knocked down by Byron. The option pass thrown short and away. And the wind will be just a little bit in the young man's face. He kicks it. It's a wobbly kick being fair caught for by number six. And well, we got a doozy going. 4.34 left in the first. Cuts back inside. Shepard gets on the 45, maybe the 46-yard line. Boy, he's quick. Pulling that uh, Terry Crouch, that 275-pound guard when they do that from that formation sometimes. Here's the inside handoff. A fumble recovered, it looks like, by the University of Houston at the 41-yard line. It is. Stanley Wilson coughed the ball up. Illustration of what happened in that last play. Big turnover. Back on top and almost intercepted. Second down at 10 now. Lionel Wilson is the quarterback. He's having trouble throwing, just finding the receiver. They say, here's the option play, and fumbled, and then recovered going out of bounds. Now we got a passing situation. Third down and 12. Roberson is a young man flanked to the top of your screen. He's coming back for feet, coming across the middle. In and out of the hands. The ball might have been too hot. To Great running back, Warren McVay, who really popularized his rear offense. Elber Watts waiting for a advantage kick. It bounces. 34, it's down there. In San Francisco at Candlestick against the amazing 49ers. All that right here on CBS. Wilson out over the 40-yard line and very quickly. Done good there. <laughs> Two national championships in nine years for Barry Switzer at Oklahoma. That's tough to beat. That time he was normal. Wilson gets hit behind the line, still gets out to the 45, gets the best rushing team in the country. Balance left. Oh, hit behind the line is Wilson. Brady Turner can see a lot. The fewest punts in the league were made for, in the NCAA were made by Oklahoma. This time it was almost blocked. He got an end over end job. It's out to the 30 yard line. <laughs> and he's confident he'll be, he'll be a winner. <laughs> Wilson throwing to the outside. Roberson didn't know where he was going. There's a flag drop. <laughs> this back is wrong. First down. Definitely was a good call. Looked like it at the time. Inside handoff. But that's the way you learn. When you're young and you're talented, you've got to put it up. Inside move. A good option play outside. But he's jammed there. Number 43 is the one carrying the ball. It's not as basically simple as it used to be. As I mentioned earlier, they have a zone option. They have a trap option. They have a rollout option. An outside rear option. An option pass turned into a lot. It looks like it gets close to the first down. Hayworth is back. Here's the punt. It's a pretty good-looking kick. Hits and runs down to the end zone. And it's a leaping spike. See, he looked like he knocked it out. By Durham, almost knocked it out. Let's... They'll get off this play. And then be going against the wind. Here's a reverse by Shepard. He's going deep for a back coming out. And it's off his hands at the 45-yard line. Buster Rhymes. And the first quarter is now history. It's 7-0. Oscar and Freddie Dreyer at the Sun Bowl in El Paso. And the Oklahoma Sooners scored on a Shepard touchdown run. The 179th game, by the way, that they have scored touchdowns in. That's the record. Shepard fumbles the lateral back. Big pressure was put on him. And Alvin Ross recovers it. Unbalanced line again this time. Inside handoff to Stanley Wilson. 
dragging a few players out to over the 15-yard line. Red McLean, I never noticed that much. Okay, here's the kick. That's Lionel Fee back to take it on the 40. He's got some running room. He may have a wall. Lionel Fee's being chased and finally dropped at the 41-yard line. Country, it's a great classic. Inside handoff. Didn't fool anybody that time. I yeah, I know you, you love that. <laughs> Second down and call it nine. Only a two-yard pickup was anything. Here's the inside move by Lionel Wilson, and he is being sworn under. Crowd still under control. That's hard to believe. Lionel Wilson now. Oh, good thing. He's got time to throw whatever he wants to do with it. Five number 32, Alan Polk makes a good catch. The senior. Inside handoff. Wow, he is met head on at the 44-yard line. Second down and nine. And the double coverage again on the outside. They've got to get, try to get the ball inside. Oh, he's getting a lot of time to throw right now. Good looking throw. As Speed takes it in traffic. Another first down for Houston and a good throw by Lionel Wilson. He is already there, of course. I think we'll be watching him on CBS and the NFL later on. Down. Polk gets down to the 25 yard line. He's having some kind of a, a good afternoon so far. Second down, five. On the run, Wilson. To Ford. Happened to be on that It's a pretty good place to start. Pretty good company. And uh, he started at uh, Michigan State. He was at Michigan State in 1954 when I was at Purdue. And so we became good friends. 35,000 people here. And they're making the stadium big enough to hold 52 in another year or so. And it's less than a yard. And it's fourth down. Lionel Wilson is going to try to keep it himself. It doesn't make it. As Dwight Drain, the sophomore, the guy on the whole field of the 22 people with a shirt tail hanging out. That's a great sign of a great defensive lineman. <laughs> Shades of Rich Glover a few years ago. Wait a minute. Oh. Tack it in and keep it in. You used to use thumbtacks on your ends, hands, too. You did everything. Here's the handoff to Buster Rhymes. <laughs> Third down. And call it five yards. Inside handoff. Stanley Wilson. Who else? Wilson up the middle. Then the very dangerous return person. Ooh, takes a step toward the line and kicks a sort of an end zone header type kick. Taken by Vonner. The pass caught by Fee. That would be the seventh completion for a good point. I like Ronell Fee. He does catch it with people hanging on and around him. Here's the inside drive play. Cuts back inside. Wilson gets right in the middle of the Sun Bowl symbol. We hope ship feels better. Sanders is playing well. Here's the rollout by Wilson. He's got some room. Well, there was no doubt he was just going to keep it that time. Gets almost to the 40-yard line. First of Houston hasn't been actually sports for as many years as most schools. That's Wiggins getting the carry straight up the middle. From, uh, from uh, Oklahoma on the freeway without a radiator. Can you believe it? Make sure you don't feed those animals any of that rice. It's unbelievable. Allen Polk inside. Remember, the Cougars got down here the series before and missed on fourth and a foot. Let's see what will happen this time. Wilson's being stopped at the 25-yard line. All right, second down and nine. The ball's on the 25. Got a lot of time to pass. Lionel Wilson with all the time in the world, maybe nobody open. Good throw to the sidelines, almost at the 15-yard line. It is very short. Third inside. Those Wiggins head down, taking the handoff, winning this percentage in football. Here's the reverse option play. Allen Polk takes run out of bounds. Wilson. All right, Roberson is out that way. The young man with all the speed. Second down and eight on the 13. Back to the weak side is where Wilson's going. He logs this one out of the end zone. There is a flag down, though, as the receiver was forced out. That would have been that's Fee over there. That's the good outside receiver on that side. Here's the bump and... Defensive interference in the end zone. It's first down, one yard line. 341 left. The wind to the Cougars back. Inside drive. Wilson takes it himself and scores. Ryan Wilson scores. And if the extra point is good, if it's a kick, we will have that tie game. 44. The wide bars in college football. It's good. Boy, it's really good. A sailor with 3.39 left before halftime here in beautiful El Paso, Texas. It's a 7-7 tie. And nobody's going home for this kickoff. 
Ball is out of the end zone. It goes over the uprights. Where's all the gold in California these well, days? Well, some of it's in the bank account in Nashville, thank God. <laughs> <laughs> we'll take all we can get. The great country and western man, Larry Gantler with the Gantler brothers. That's Alvin Ross on the outside toss play. Balance line to the right. We're going to take a look at that. Here's the drive series. It's up by Shepard. Keeps it herself behind that extra blocker. All the way to the 46. Crouch at left guard is at least 275. It is Mammoth. Here's Shepard back. Getting rushed. Gets it off. A good pass. Intercepted. Almost out is intercepted the 20 yard line. That's Easton. Easy Easton, they call him. Racing to the 40. A 26th interception for the Cougars in a season when the young backs have really played some defense. Shepard throwing off the back foot. And here Houston has possession. The sixth interception for Easton. A long pass by Lionel Wilson, and it's just over Fee. Just over Fee's hands, and I mean he was motoring. The sky is cobalt blue. That's what they call it. Here's the inside fake and the toss back. That's Wiggins chasing it down. Back to throw again. Lionel Wilson. Takes some time. He's trying to scream back to the far side to Alan Pope. Read pretty well by the Oklahoma defense. The punt. Or uh, Haywood is back. Bouncy over his head. They're trying to go in the end zone. It's a race, and it will. It'll come out to the 20-yard line. The Alabama coach. All that at halftime today, right here from the Sun Bowl to New York. Run off the left side. Looks like they're content now. He's quite a young player. Inside handoff. Stanley Wilson. Oh, out to the 35 yard line. First and 10 with 50 seconds left in, in county. Inside by Shepard Keith. He's got a lot of room outside. He's going to stay with it himself for the 44 before he's up in. The way was holding his left side on the sidelines. It might be the ribs. Hopefully, nothing real serious. The ball trying to be thrown by Shepard, and I don't know if the arm came forward or if they're going to call it a fumble. Third down and a short one. Reverse handoff option. Shepard, a good runner, gets to midfield, and then he stopped. 1936, the sun started shining. Here it is on first down. Shepard trying to sneak out. Gets the ball spiked by a big defensive lineman and caught, and now run out of bounds. Alvin Ross. Shepard being rushed and gets away at the 30. Shepard now fumbling and not getting away at the 33-yard line. Big Trust was the one that forced him out of bounds, and both teams are going in to get the tape all set. Here's the first and 10 now, right on the 30-yard line. Inside drive, the handoff to Freddie Sams. Freshman gets out over the 40 to the 42 in a hurry. What have you, at that height, sometimes better be a little stocky. And make sure you're fast. If you're short, you better be fast. Here's the ball, and it sends again out to midfield. Making people play on the line of scrimmage and take it, trying to take advantage of the seams they have and the gaps on defense. The straight wishbone now. No more fooling around with the flankers. That's Alvin Ross. He did a pretty good job for CJ. Good coach, of course. Yeah, one of the greatest. Here's the outside move. Shepard gets a good tackle put on him at the 47-yard line, and it stops right there. It's second down. <laughs> second down, 11. The ball's on the 48 of Houston. Inside drive. That's Sims. Oh, he slides off that first block very quickly. Third down and seven. Shepard is, they've taken the opening kickoff, and the young quarterback is moving now. Oh, he doesn't get there. Number 89 really socks it. He just doesn't punt a lot. That can the fewest times in the nation. Oh, he drills this one. Gets the win and all, he just kicks it right out. Oklahoma and Houston. It's been even they got their eyes open today. Here's a handoff to Durham on the left side. Lionel Wilson, the quarterback, one of the great athletes in the country. Roberson is flanked to the right. Inside, Alan Pope diving forward, climbing. Here's the inside fake and keep. 240-pound sophomore. That's Marshall over there. Scott Marshall. They'll work him and get him back in here if they can. Here's the pass play. It's complete to Fee. In traffic again. And enough for another first down for Houston. You've got to be a fast athlete to be up quarterback. Here's the handoff inside to Allen Polk. Again getting yardage. It's going to be called second and five. Just in Oklahoma territory. Reverse handoff option out to the weak side. This is, this is the runner. Wilson as the quarterback inside the 40. So they've done a much better, but better job defensively than uh, we expected the way they talked about their defense. First down give to Durham. 
Second down and five. The play from Barry Switzer. Of course, Galen Hall is the offensive coordinator. My old buddy from Penn State. Let's see what they're going to do on defense. Here's their good defensive play by Oklahoma. I believe they have a fumble recovered. Strong safety blitz that time. Gary Lowell that time, number 25, blitzing on the play. And Stanberry, I believe, his running mate may have come up with the football. The is in there for him, and that's a full bone. That's the wishbone. First and ten, the ball's on the 45. Inside handoff to Sims, a freshman. New in the television business, and it's going to be a lot of fun, Fred. You're doing a good job down there. Here's the inside drive play. That's Sims again. Boy, he is quick. Sims is still on this people at 30, cutting back. Sims is dragged down the 14-yard line from behind. He got there in a hurry. Shepard is the quarterback. And he's the Houdini, too. It's first down. To the left side. Sims. Delay a game. Offense. First down and 15 with that five-yard penalty. A lot of shifting going on in that defensive side. Here's the toss. Back to Buster Rhymes, the 6'3", 215-pounder. All right, big play. Second down and 15. Option left side by Shepard. Toss back to Alvin Ross. Alvin Ross has running room and gets to the 10-yard line. Yes, 195 pounder picks up a good. It's third down and six. This is the biggest play of the game so far. You're talking about points. Shepard, now the flags are down. Shepard still carried it. Everybody stopping because they see the flags, but Shepard does it. Now we'll get the call by the officials. Illegal. Illegal motion. We've got a third down and 11 call on the 15. Oklahoma driving. Inside, Shepard keeps it. He's going to get to the 15 and get a lot of. The Dallas Cowboys is his idol. The shoe is off, the foot is up. It's good. Looks like Sepien's been working with the young man from Dallas. Keeley drives it through, and the Sooners go back on top by three. It'll be a good contest, no question about that. And of course, the NFL today will be in Philadelphia, right at the site, so that'll all be right there from the city of brotherly love. Here's Alan Polk on the outside, taking the pitch from Wilson, Roberson, the young sophomore is to the bottom of the screen. Here's the inside handoff to Alan Polk. What do you think? They play a little wide in there? Yeah, I think they are sometimes. They're worried about the trap. They got it. That time they faked the trap again and ran the trap option. Good and defense. They play off. Look at that middle. Go, Dave! Lionel Wilson. Oop, almost fumbled the snap. Rolling on the run. Dumps it out to his tight end, Mark Ford, who is drilled at the 37-yard line. And in red. Everybody has red on either Houston's or Oklahoma's. The outside blitzing this time. Lionel dumps it out. He is wide open. This is Durham. Durham at the 30 being chased. Durham is knocked out of bounds and the ball fumbles out of the end zone, but there was no control. Elbert Watts made the tackle. Let's see if they're going to give Oklahoma the football and a touchback. And watch, he gets hit from the backside. The ball bounces right into the end zone. Oklahoma has on the 20. Shepard with the inside handoff to Sims, Freddie Sims. He'll handle it. But he isn't happy. 1-10 left in the third period. Handoff to Buster Rhymes. Being held. They don't throw it that much with a risk of the bottom anyway. Breaking out over is Freddie Sims. He's still on his feet. Sims, breaking tackles, gets to the 50-yard line. Honor falling on him there. Byford, the big offensive right tackle, doing a good job at the point of attack. Here's Shepard, stayed inside. He's going to go. Shepard breaks out with some good blocking from the outside, inside the 20, and now pulled down on the 10-yard line by Grady Turner. The fourth quarter, fourth quarter will get underway. Oklahoma has a 10-7 lead. We'll be back for the Sun Bowl coverage after this word from your local... And by Exxon, working on energy for you. The full bone, the bone is in for Oklahoma and Switzer's team. Inside drive play, fake, kept by Shepard, cutting back inside, stays on his feet. Shepard down to the three-yard line with a great run. Shepard with 101 yards now on 16 carries. Third down and three. Inside, awfully close to Sims. We're going to do that cage. All right, first and goal. Quarterback sneak by Shepard. Touchdown. The second touchdown for the Oklahoma quarterback of the day. Bechtold, the big offensive center, clear in the way. The kick is like Tony Franklin, it was true. 
17 to 7, a 10 point spread. It was not at halftime, 7 all. Oklahoma looks like they're getting to go to work here in the fourth period. Time, they've played a lot of games in that There's Keeley's kick. It's a deep one. Out of the end zone. They're trailing now by 10. Lionel Wilson, the quarterback. Back to throw. Being chased, which he likes. Ooh, knocked down. Good looking. Good looking little trip right at the nine and a half yard line. Two sidelines. They need points. The wind is in the face of the young quarterback replacement. Back inside. Good looking keeper on his first play out over the 20. That's Jerry Dickens. Than any other team but the Cougars. It's third down and 10. The play by Dickens on the run, throwing to the left. Has Fee open. Fee at the 31 yard line draws a crowd. They just Low ball throw. Right now it's first down and 10. Good play. Lionel hands off out to the 35. Alan Polk. If you win, then you go home from the bowl game and say, boy, that was the best trip I ever had. Here's the reverse handoff thrown badly by Lionel Wilson. Wow, Alan Polk has it back on the 13-yard line. Up and might have thrown it a little bit prematurely. Inside drive, it's the give. Out to the 20-yard line, still on his feet, is Alan Polk. For the center, Lonnie Stokes back to punt. Uh, not a good kick. In fact, uh, it's right into the Oklahoma bench at about the 37-yard line. It's 17-7, under... 10 minutes left in the fourth quarter, and Oklahoma has the football in Houston territory. That's Freddie Sims, the brilliant freshman. <laughs> second, second down and seven. Inside handoff. Freddie Sims again. Third down and four. Pretty tight formation. The bone is there. Three backs. Inside drive option to the weak side. Toss. Back to Buster Ryan. He had a 42-yarder this year and a 53-yarder a year ago. This will be from the 39, so it's a 49-yarder. Wow. Well, that would have carried. That one did go almost to the ambulance out of the end zone. What a kick. 20 to 7. That would have been good from 65. 20 to 7. Oklahoma getting connected. Bill Wolf's done some kind of a job with those 49 He really has. It's a great coaching. There always was. You were a great coach. Inside handoff. Now, Lionel Wilson going across the middle. Misses Mark Ford by a lot. He earned that with good hustling play. Ready to cover the fumble in the end zone. He got it out of there. It scored right afterward. There's Franklin. Patrick Franklin. Third down and seven. He's got some time. Wilson out in the flat. That's Jordan with the football. Jordan gets to the 36-yard line. Lionel Wilson inside. Hand off now. Toss back. Uh-oh. Fumble. And Oklahoma has the football. Alan Polk could not get the option lateral put away, and Whaley came up with it. Early, somebody moved or maybe drew him off. Terry Monroe came. Offense. First and 15. Shepard with the full bone. Inside drive, and he gives it to Freddie Sims. Well, I go to school at SMU, but my heart's in El Paso. What happened to the SMU uh, Mustangs? Oh, uh, we got caught cheating, I guess. <laughs> Too bad. Back to you guys. All right, Freddie Sims. Sims was not caught. He just scored a touchdown with a great run. He's keeping the ball. He's only a freshman. He may have a house that's going to look like a sporting goods place. He now who's getting a workout. He bangs it. And it's good. They've done a very sophisticated job with it. All right, Keeley kicking off. Jordan will wait for it. This is a fairly short kick taken at the 10 yard line by Wiggins. Back out over the 25. Jim Rogers and Johnny Fulmer just kept after him for years to bring Oklahoma to El Paso, and the players love it. Mark Ford making the catch, but not for much yardage. And when they do it, Oklahoma. Reversed by Lionel Wilson going outside. It's his receiver who gets away from somebody at the 45. I say when they used to do it, people used to boo in the stands. Straight away drive. Up. First and 10 now. The toss back as Wilson is going to keep it himself and throws it into the rug. Second down and 10. The ball's in the 48. A 27 to 7 score. 
Oklahoma's come out and really put it to the Cougars in the second half. Here's the straight drop back out of the fake. A little play action. Pretty good throw on the outside, but it's away. As long as they can run fast. Remember, this game is for recruiting rights of Texas and other places. Good luck at throw and a good catch to the 40-yard line. I believe that's Roberson that may successful, wouldn't you think? I would think so. Here's coming out now. This is just a rollout. And Wilson isn't about to give it up. Inside the 35 and out of bounds, which will stop the clock. Started every drive on the 20-yard line with the exception of the one they got in the 50. Good handoff. A big hole opened up as Patrick Franklin got through there so quick. First and 10 on the 27. Houston driving, but they're trailing. Good throw on the run to Mark Ford. Quite a receiver. A small town. Good country boys make good football players sometimes. Here we go inside. That's Franklin. Man, can he run to the 15-yard line? A great institution. If you don't go to class, you can't play. It's as simple as that. Donald Jordan straight ahead. <laughs> Three and a half minutes left. L Lionel getting off inside. Lionel Wilson to Alan Pope. Oh, it certainly does. Good people. Third down and three, the down and the six. Wilson tossing back. Wow. Standing up. Donald Jordan scores. The 200-pounder, the sophomore. Player running back. He's very fine. Yeah, and everybody else felt they were, they were going to use him as a handback. I think he was impressed with the fact that he could play quarterback. Sure. But then his kick is good. It's suddenly 27 to 14. Barefooted. There, it's over the 10 yards. It's a live potato, and it's taken by Oklahoma, the 42-yard line. They're going to do it again. Try the outside kick again, Thomas. All right, this time from the 45, which means that Oklahoma was over the restraining line, probably. Because the sidewinder is trying to find a way he can kick it. Oh, he's going to use his left foot. Does. Doesn't go the 10 yards, I don't believe. Now there's going to be a penalty on that. 2.54 left, 27 to 14. Side handoff and not much. It's Freddie right. Sims. Pro players we had at Kansas City. Stop it! People came from good programs. Oh, they had a great oh, look at this. That's Freddie Sims. <laughs> I wonder how many pairs of shoes he wore. <laughs> Here's the full wishbone inside. That's Sims again. the touchdown. Here's Keeley's extra point tackle. Oop, hits the goal post. Bounces back and is almost fair caught. That's no good. It's about the first thing that's happened wrong against Oklahoma. Either that or else you look at, it, look at it as a very positive thing. It's, it's very accurate. 130 left. A 33 to 14 Oklahoma edge. Or bulges in this case. Down the middle incomplete. 126 left. Lionel Wilson had a big day passing, but can't get those points. Oh, that's, it. that's Johnny Truitt. Oklahoma rolling now. Johnny Truitt, the sophomore, the left end or linebacker, if you will. Johnny Truitt. Oh, and they had some great linebackers. Shout and Cumbie. Of course, before that, Jerry Tubbs. Some great people, great linebackers. And job Oklahoma from a 7-7 tie has blown it open out of sight okay here's Hope kicking off taking it to two yard line by Donald Jordan he's got some running room look out 25 yard line Switzer was laughing on that same television show and he said we lead the whole world in fumbles I get some real good defensive clubs throughout the year Patrick Franklin, the sprinter. I don't know how he makes all the schedules. Sam Jenkins, Sandy Sanders, of course, our big boot man. Jan Wheeler, and of course, Jimmy Rogers. And as we said, this wherever you are, we hope that your day has been somewhat warm and made mellow because of what you're going to see on CBS. Here's V, going to throw a pass off the end around and throws a real bullet to the 40-yard line. That's Roberson, his counterpart, the outside flanker who caught it. Defensive team will crawl all over you. Yeah, the Ray Perkins and his staff, really, if he could play four quarters, he might set a few marks that would last. That's it. Oklahoma 
Oklahoma with a second half rush. Beat the Houston Cougars 40 to 14.